I'm down at uh, Corville Reservoir with my buddy Travis and we're uh, fishing for some carp and we're going to do a test to see which is better, pop-ups or whole kernel corn. For uh, pop-ups we're using Sticky Baits Signature Pop-ups, World Classic Baits Banana Pop-ups, and CC Moore Ester Cream Pop-ups. We've got five lines out, so three of them have pop-ups. Uh, one has just straight whole kernel corn and the other one has the super cast banana flavored whole kernel corn. I'll put a link in the description for all these baits. Okay, for the rigs I'm using a blowback rig on the pop-ups and with the banana boilies I've been using the banana glug and also this 3D dye. This 3D dye is some pretty cool stuff. I'll show you that right now. So you just put it on there and you let it sit and dry on there, but I'll just show you what it looks like quickly in the water. Nice. All right, fish on. Got him. That was on the um, sticky baits. There's the little pop up floating there. Alright, my second one of the day. This one came on a pop up. And uh, yeah, so far it's five to one for uh, whole kernel corn. What's that fish four for you or five? Uh, that is five, I believe. <laughs> it's hard when they're slippery and without that cradle, you know? Yeah. All right, I got it. <laughs> Almost. Almost yeah. All right, got him. So we're not having any luck with the uh, ester ester fruit, the CC Moore. No bites on that or anything. So we're gonna try this Nash Bait Citrus Pop Ups. They're white. They come with a little spray bottle here. See if we get anything on one of those. Oh, 
was on the WCB banana pop-up. Pretty solid run. Oh, I think this is the biggest of the day. Messed up looking carp. Got him on the uh, WCB banana pop-up. Probably the biggest one from today though. Gotta push this over. Yep. See the numbers. Oh yeah, that's a mirror. Got him. Nice. Look at that beauty. Get the other side. Oh. Pretty nice, it's not very big, but nice catch. Yeah, seems pretty decent. Nice. Oh, barely hooked. Another one on the uh, whole kernel corn on the circle hook. Looks like he's got a spawn uh, spawning scar. He's not very heavy. Eight point eight point three. Yeah, around there. Not bad. Um, I think both of them are gone. No, I think I got a double. I think so. Yeah, you want to grab this other one? Do you want to grab that one? That one's going pretty good. Yeah, they both went off at the same time. Oh yeah, yeah, I definitely have one on here. Yeah, there's one on here too. Oh, there's no doubt about that. <laughs> That's awesome. I don't know if I'm tangled or you're getting a run. Oh shoot, I'm getting another one on that far rod. <laughs> we got a triple here. <laughs> and there's one on mine. No, I think I'm hooked okay, up okay. to yours. Holy shit. This is yeah. 
All right, that's one for the boilie. I have one on mine too. Look at that. Oh yeah, we we, we got four going here. <laughs> what the? You're gonna have to knit him yourself. Yep, have to try bring him across all these rods. There's still one on mine. Oh no, he's coming in. Yeah, this guy's still on yours. Oh, they come in waves, they come in waves. Oh yeah. Oh man, he's going right for that snag too. You go right ahead. Oh, this is a decent one. Oh yeah. Oh shoot. The rig's still in this one. That is a nice one. Yeah. Oh. One thing just needs to itself. Yeah. Oh yeah, I think that's your PB. Oh, I think so too. Um. What should we do here? Just put him in that sack and uh, him up kind of? zip it up. Yeah. Just unhook him. Oh, I caught both your lines on this one. All right, this is just mayhem. This is number three and we got one more on. Just gonna do a quick unhook. Is he still there? Yep. Nice. Wow, quadruple. That was crazy. Yeah. We had four on at one time. Oh, yeah. Is that a big one? I can't tell. It looks decent. Watch the snag right there in front of you. Yeah. To your left a little. Yeah, oh yeah? Oh nice. Oh well, hopefully this one's your PB. Oh yeah. 13.85. So that was 10.3? Yep, so not quite. 10.35? Hold that, baby. I think they're pretty close in size. Yeah, I think that one is bigger, though. I think so, too. I want to get a link on the two. 29? 29 and a close. bit. Yeah. Pretty nice double up for you. Oh, yeah. Do you want me to take pictures with your phone? Yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah, let's, let's, uh, I'll get a picture with this one and then uh, you toss them back and we'll weigh the yeah. second one.
go up to watch the video on that and see if I got hit in the face there. I definitely felt a little bit. Alright. Alright, got him. Yep. Okay. Let's get a Alright. Yeah, that's definitely a contender for my PB. That's a good size. Oh yeah, that's PB. Yep. Eleven and a quarter. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. That's awesome. And it was on my rod too. Nice. All the better. Biggest of the day. The nice thing about these citrus boilies is uh, they come with this little spray. You can just spray it. And I'm getting a run. I'll let him go for a minute. While I cast this out. Oh, nice. All right, I'm good. I'm good. Another one on the uh, whole kernel corn. It's my eighth fish of the day. Oh. Wrong way. Eight to eleven. Yep, and I guess uh, 16 to 3. Oh yeah, he's got a big gash right there. <laughs> Number nine, I think. And again on the uh, corn. Oh, really? Nice. Oh, wow, he must have been running for a while. Nice. Number 10. Again on the whole kernel corn on the circle hook. So that was the end of our uh, fishing there. Um, Travis, he ended up with 12 carp and I ended up with 10. Um, almost all of them except three came off of the whole kernel corn on a circle hook. Of the three that were caught with the blowback rigs, two were caught on the world classic baits, banana pop-ups, and uh, one of them was caught on the signature sticky baits pop-ups. We also tried um, those Nash citruses, but didn't get any on that. And the CC Moore ester creams, we didn't get any on that, those either. But yeah, pretty much everything came on the circle hooks with the whole kernel corn. The Supercast whole kernel corn, that was pretty effective as well. Um, they're a nicer bait. They stay on the hook a bit longer, but they are a bit more expensive. I think the, the carp seemed to prefer the regular corn flavor to the banana flavor that I had. Yeah, it was a pretty good day. Um, got that mirror carp, which I was happy about, and then we had that quadruple up, which was pretty good. Yeah, it was all pretty fun.
five hours of fishing and 22 fish. It's pretty good.